Many Hampton Roads residents have likely had some experience in the armed forces, but many civilians often wonder what it's like to serve. The U.S. Navy Fleet Forces has a program that gives journalists across the country an opportunity to be a sailor for a day. Photojournalist Jason Walsh took part. The Sailor for a Day program, it gives, you know, media and folks within the media space an opportunity to come on board, see what it's like to live this life, see what it's like to go throughout your day to day. It really gives a great sense for media to be able to convey then out to the public. Or what's it like being a United States sailor? The training that we did today was seeing how one can swim when in flight gear. Dealing with all of the restrictions of the clothing of the gear, practicing how to tread water, how to drown proof, things that you can do to extend your survivability in cold water. Three, two, one, get set. The reason why it's so important is because you know you're not always gonna be flying over solid ground, right? You need to know how to get out of your aircraft safely and how to extend your survivability in water until that rescue comes. I've been in the Navy for 16 years. Started out, I've always wanted to fly and be a naval aviator. So luckily I had the opportunity to do that. So I'm mean, kind of a, a jack of all trades aircraft, so we get to be proficient in a whole lot of mission sets. So anything from uh, search and rescue to fleet logistics, carrying people and cargo. But uh, what's really kept me uh, kind of going is, is really the people and getting the opportunity to, uh, to lead these sailors out here. There's a whole lot of work that I think people don't see that uh, really goes into making th these things fly and helping uh, serve the country.